amphibians globally are faced with extinction. You know, not since the uh, extinction of the dinosaur has this planet ever seen a mass extinction like this. And amphibians are incredibly important to the, to the planet. Uh, not only as uh, insect control, which is a great thing, you know, the frogs and toads will actually eat some of the harmful insects that impact people. The mosquitoes that carry West Nile viruses and things like that are actually eaten by amphibians. Other things eat amphibians. When you take amphibians out of the picture, a huge amount of food for certain animals is taken away. Well, there's a number of causes, but the three big ones are habitat destruction, pollution, and disease. Just about every department in the zoo, whether it's research, education, uh, marketing, the animal side, is involved in amphibian conservation. The animal department, our specialty is keeping frogs and toads newts and salamanders alive in captivity. We do what we call population assurance colonies. So that when the animals are in the wild and they completely disappear, we, at least we know that we have animals in captivity that someday if the problems that made the animals go extinct are fixed, we can put the animals back. Zoo membership and zoo attendance directly affect our amphibian conservation area. We don't have outside funding from a granting source or from private donations. People coming to the zoo directly affects that area and our ability to propagate critically endangered species and one day return them to the wild.